Hello everyone, today I wanted to um, do another uh, rig uh, assembly for my uh, Blackmagic full frame 6K. I got the uh, Falcom F50 uh, plate, base plate. I already mount uh, uh, the squared one uh, on top of this. Um, um, oh, sorry, on top of the plate here. Here and the uh, the mount uh, here, the F50 mount underneath the uh, cage, so they fit perfectly. Um, also, so also I need to mount uh, the, my new uh, MBNE uh, case. I got this one uh, because uh, the other one. Was only a discovery was only 10 uh, gigabit, and this one is 20 uh, gigabit. So I had problems with the recording. So the the e issue that I found is this is fit perfectly inside the here, uh, as I remember. I I showed. So it, it basically fits perfectly. Uh, you can see. Slide perfectly, so I can tie it with the with the screw. This one, it's uh, much smaller, so I need to figure out. I figure out a, a screw. You see, there is a space inside here. I don't know if you can tell. Oops, sorry. Uh, right here, I figure out uh, a screw to put in and to tighten this one down. Give me a second and I have uh... okay so uh, it doesn't fit uh, perfectly so I need to use a, a screw but it's not a big deal. So I'm going to mount right now the this plate on the bottom like this. Uh, I have three screws I set up and let me lock this guy. Okay, so let's move there, and I want to put this guy. Um, so this is the screw that I figure out. There is a one fourth in the back and three eighths in the front. So I'm going to mount it like that, like this. Okay. Let me get the. Okay, perfectly. Okay, want to slide it in the front. Okay. And okay. And okay, like that. Okay. And then I, I put the screw here so that I can hold this one inside the. the uh, this hole that I have. So I'm going to slide this guy and slide it to the side and then tighten this guy like that. Okay. So that is it doesn't move. Okay. Yeah, like that. Let me check if I have um, uh, should be this guy. Yeah. Okay. I want to tie it too much because it's the MVNE. So right now I have this set up so that I can slide in. The F50 on the bottom. Okay. Like that. And of course, the black magic goes on top of it. Hmm, goes like that. Okay, let me. Okay, let me. Let this is simpler. 
and that's it. And it's locked in. You see? Now it's pretty high this one, but compared to other uh, systems that I saw, it's not that much. I wish this plate, base plate, where the rods are in, inserted would uh, have integrated this F50 uh, Falcon system. It would be great to have that. Maybe in the future, I don't know. So, this one, like that. I, re I removed the, um, the Sigma uh, M21 adapter from Sigma 2L mount because uh, for my Sigma um, 35 to 105 because right now I got the the new IREX 30 millimeter here which is pretty heavy so I I would need a let me get that I would need definitely a uh, to um, sustain the battery with the whole battery, uh, no battery, sorry, the, the lens uh, with the lens holder for sure. Let me move a second here. So I can remove the black magic cap and let's see how this goes. Okay, should be that done. Like that. Okay. Done. Okay, so and it's set up. The cool part here is that uh, the plate. I put the plate uh, towards the front, so it won't it won't uh, tilt forward, which is really good. Um, yeah, that's it. So this is the build. Basically, I just need to put the battery in the back. I'm going to use the ba this battery holder here. MPR, MP, FSP, sorry. I always forget it. MPF 970, this one, okay. Goes on top of here, okay. And then there are the cabling that I need to uh, do. But this is the system, so Blackmagic full frame, uh, 6K, the RX 30mm. This is the uh, metric one because they have even the imperial, so you have feet and meters, whatever. Oh, uh, what is missing is let me move the caps from here. What is missing is the uh, the small rig man box and this guy. The hole is 95 millimeter, which is the actual size of the uh, RX. So let me move the cap. Mm. That's it. Oh, cool part that there is a this is a line here that will align with the the line of the lens so you you know a straight and that's it so this is the system I can put uh, some uh, handle from the Falcon system that's it one and here on the side the other one okay 
But let me put you on the side so you can see the build. Now I need to put the uh, lens um, support here, and then I need to put the um, Nucleus Nano 2 motors. I got two motors, so let me move this guy a bit further there. And here is the controller, and here is the motor one. Uh, and motor 2 I need to set it up them so I'll do another time but I wanted to show you how these are uh, mounted so let me move the controller on the side for now okay I don't have enough space so sorry about that um, so I want to mount this too. So to mount this too, I need to put it on the side this guy and to slide this one. It's going to be tough. Mm. Let me do one thing. Let me move uh, the camera. Okay, let me move the camera a second. So I'm going to okay. And I'm going to mount this to motor here. Yes, one. A bit more snug here. Let me. Okay, so I'm going to Okay, should be okay like that Perfect Band, so they are slide. Okay. Put this just. Okay, great. And now let's put back the camera. Okay. goes on top like this and should slide easily in okay and done it's locked right oh sorry and done okay so now let me put on the side this so you can see the motors here are the motors now I don't think they will reach yeah that's what I thought so let me yeah they don't reach the the uh, with the other with the other lens uh, I think it worked, but with this one it won't reach. Okay. Uh, yeah, so I need to uh, figure out something else for the motors. Anyway, 
I'm going to use one of use my this other uh, um, rod and put it here somewhere here. For example, this guy right there, or close on a on more on the bottom. I have to figure out then, and uh, that should work. And and the other thing is I so let me move the camera here a bit and let me slide this guy. It's like a Lego type of uh, build. So this is the uh, Falcon F22 to another rail here, and this is to hold the uh, control system. Okay. And it goes on the bottom. Like that. And it locks. And so this guy now, the controller, it can go uh, in different places. So I can put it here, uh, like this for example. I can put it on the On the handle, for example, oh sorry, this way, like that, and I can control both the the controller. For example, this is the focus, this is the zoom, so I control both of them. I can do that, or I can put. Uh, this one on on the side here and control it like that. So I have different options um, and then the uh, mounting option and then it depends uh, how um, it's, it's more comfortable when, uh, when I'm shooting. Um, yeah. So I'm going to do another video for that calibrating um, the, the um, Nucleus Nano 2 controller and the two motor with the with the lens and connecting to the uh, black magic uh, full frame and I'm going to show you how it works but this I wanted to show you that um, a better a better uh, build with the uh, let me mount to this guy so better build with the uh, f50 uh, f50 uh, Falcon system, so I have a better, a better setup for my uh, rig. Okay, and that's it. So if you have any question, please uh, let me know. Leave it in the comment section. Um, I'm going to do another video about the Nano Two and how you set up the motors and uh, where I'm going to set up this guy. Um, I tested with the other lens and uh, I didn't have, uh, now I remember, I didn't have the F50 so both motor could reach but now with the F50 they, you see, missing like 2 centimeters. So the F50 uh, got 2 centimeters from the space and uh, the, the motor uh, wheel gear don't reach the gear of the lens, okay? Well, that things happen, so I need to figure out that. Not going to be any big issue. And that's it. So, just wanted to show you my progress in building uh, my rig. I guess this is uh, the second um, uh, part. Hopefully next, uh, next time I have everything set up. I'm still learning all this stuff and all the different uh, options that there uh, that exist. I think the Falcon system is pretty good. Uh, now I need to figure out this motor uh, thing, and uh, I will get to my my rig uh, final rig uh, build. Uh, um, that's it. If you have any comments or suggestions, uh, um, please leave it in the comment section. 
and I have all the links about all the uh, this accessory and product uh, I got uh, for my uh, rig in the description and I'll see you on next video bye bye